My name is Julia Hagen, and um, this is my story. My story starts in middle school when I was bullied by um, a lot of kids in class just for not being pretty, not for being the skinniest girl in the class, um, just not being the way the world thought I should be. And that led me to not liking what I saw. Um, that led me to hating people. That led me to being the bully. And that was really hard. Um, so I was in middle school and I was making hate lists. I was um, getting called to the principal's office. I was gossiping. I was spreading rumors. Um, I was cheating. I was just being altogether mean. And that's just not who Jesus made me to be. And throughout that whole time, I really had it good. Um, my family was awesome. They loved me. Um, I had a good group of friends, but I didn't take advantage of that. Um, I was good at sports. I was good at school. But I think Satan has a way of taking all those good things in your life and twisting it in your brain to make you think that you're just not good enough. Um, that you're not worthy, that you're ugly, that you're fat, that you're stupid, um, and that the world doesn't like you the way Jesus made you to be. And so that led me to high school, which is a very common story as anyone. Um, that led that hate of myself led to drinking a lot and to hooking up with boys and to being um, the gossip queen and to being a hypocrite and um, and it was just this world of just ugly and just hate and um, and the whole time I didn't feel loved I couldn't love people well um, I was loved like I said by my family and by my friends but I just couldn't feel it I didn't love myself I didn't love other people well I didn't love my enemies I didn't love the Lord even though I knew him so my senior year rolled around and um, that's when Jesus totally broke into my life. He broke me physically and literally. Um, I broke my ankle in basketball practice and I was done. I was a hot mess. And that's when my assistant coach decided to bring me to Oak Ridge. Um, I guess she knew that I needed it. And so I came and I came with a bunch of my friends and even though they fell asleep during church, I was drawn to church and so I kept coming back. And that's when my testimony comes full, um, full circle because I started to know Jesus. I started to feel his love, which I've never felt before. Um, I started to get involved with a good group of people. I started coming to small groups. Um, I went to Big Stuff for the first time. And it was just a whole life change that I've never experienced before. Love is a really big deal in my life. I started to really feel the love of Jesus that he has for me when I started the internship three summers ago. Um, it was just this drastic change in my life to where I could feel Jesus' love, which helped me love myself more, which helped me love other people better, which helped me um, see that God's love is real and it's working and it's so powerful and it changes hearts, it changes thinking. And um, that love has brought me here today. Um, without Jesus' love, I would be anywhere but here. With Jesus' love, I was able to um, find a community of people who loved me for exactly who I was. With Jesus' love, I found a husband who loves me for everything that I am. I found a love for myself that God wants us to have and he desires for us. Um, and to know that we are perfectly and fearfully and wonderfully made in his image and there's nothing that can be better than that. So I'm just so grateful for Jesus' love um, because he brought me to this place and to this life and to this grace and this gift that he's given me.